Hello, what's up gamers, and today we are back with Assassin's Creed 2, the Ezio collection. So, uh, I was able to uh, synchronize the rest of the whole area before I started recording. So we will definitely have a chance of finding the rest of the codex pages in this whole area and to find uh, the next temple that we needed to get the next medallion. So, ooh. Here's a codex page right now, so let's get our hands on it. I think we'll gather the rest of the codex pages before we continue on with our next main mission in this game. Now, where's the next one? There we go. Yeah, we're definitely gonna want to get the rest of the Codex pages because it mainly has something to do with the whole main storyline. For those of you who have uh, not played this game yet or who are currently played this game yet, it's important that you get the Codex pages. Otherwise, you won't be able to beat this game. You'll understand why. Out of my way! Let's... Okay. Move! There we go. Goods will be done! Taste of what awaits them, eh? <laughs> that went fast. Okay. Yeah, somebody keeps telling me that I should be uh, fighting with the sword, and I'm like, mm, I know that the sword will do a whole lot of damage, but I rather prefer the dagger instead. I mean, I know the dagger doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but it makes a whole lot of difference for me. <laughs> and I prefer fighting with the dagger. Personally, okay, did we get all the codex pages? Okay, uh, did we get all the codex pages? Uh, yep, it looks like we got them all in this area. Yay! Okay, now let's get on with the main mission. Signori, I saw Francesco lead a battalion around the back of the Palazzo della Signoria. I fear he may be seeking another way in. Go, before it's too late. Do what you can! I'm so sorry, Messere. I don't know what came over me. If 
What is going on? <laughs> oh my god. Is there a freaking riot going on? Oh my god. <laughs> Every, uh, they have all gone mad. Oh. All right. Oh. You again? Why are you there? Uh. Slaughter him. Well, not if I kill you first, Mr. Fancy Pants. But you, there, there, get it. Yeah, you better run. A wise decision. Run. Cause you know you're definitely gonna get it killed by my dagger. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to aim. I was trying to aim so that I could throw the knife at him, but... I forgot how to do it. He will die by my dagger. Just like that guy who I just stabbed him in his brain. Yeah, you better run. Guards! Guards! No one Shut up. Coming. It's just us now. Maledetto che il diavolo ti porti! Stami lontano! Did he just kill himself? Oh my god, he committed suicide? Oh no, wait, I see a target down there. Why do I see a target down there? Is he still alive? He's still alive. Gotcha. I thought I was able to kill him now with my Felix dagger, but judge you for what you've done. It's over. This works even better. It's all over. Meglio essere felici in questa vita e aspirare a esserlo nella prossima. Requiescat in pace. Come on.
en libertad. ¡Libertad! ¡Francesco! They will definitely get the message. When I was six years old, I fell into the Arno. I soon found myself. We just assassinated down your brother's into killer. Darkness. Certain my life was at an end. Instead, I woke to the sound of my mother weeping. At her side stood a stranger, soaking and smiling at me. My mother explained that he had saved me. And so began a long and prosperous relationship between two families. Yours and mine. I am sorry I could not save your father and brothers. You have nothing to apologize for. I believe Jacobo de Pazzi played a part in their deaths. The attack on you as well. I need to find him. That coward fled before we could arrest him. Have you any leads? No. They've hidden themselves well. Hey. Jacopo was not the only conspirator to escape. If they work with Jacopo, they were surely involved in the plot against my family as well. Give me their names. Antonio Maffei, Archbishop Francesco Salviati, Stefano da Bagnone, and Bernardo Baroncelli. Bene, I will go and see my uncle. He has men stationed in the countryside. Wait, before you go. A codex page. I took it from the files of Francesco de Pazzi, seeing as he clearly no longer needs it. I've always had an interest in things of antiquity, as did your father. It is meaningful to me as well. Then consider it a gift. Che il Signore ci protegga. The Pazzi Conspirate. Jacopo di Pazzi. The money. This guy was the head of the Pazzi family, and he ran their banking business. An associate of Lorenzo de' Medici, he had nothing against him personally. So he hired four Templar hitmen to take care of the situation for him. Bernardo di Bandino Baroncelli. Brought up to hate the Medici family for the exile of his cousins, Baroncelli ran the numbers in the Pazzi bank by day and murdered for the Templars at night. It was Baroncelli who delivered the first blow. Stefano de Bagnone. Known for his cruelty, Bagnone was trained in Rome as a Templar butcher. It was Bagnone who stabbed oh. Lorenzo de' Medici in the back. Antonio Maffei. Witness to the sacking of Volterra by Florentine mercenaries, Maffei blamed Lorenzo. He joined the Templars to seek revenge. It was Maffei who slashed Lorenzo's neck. Archbishop Francesco Salviati. Convinced he would be the next Archbishop of Florence, Salviati was enraged when Lorenzo stood in his way. But the Templars were there to heal his wounds. It was Salviati who marched their troops into the city. Ezio, thank God you're all right. This madness with the Medici and the Pazzi, is this why you pursued Francesco? Not exactly. Well, whatever your reasons, the city is safe again thanks to you. Now tell me, how may I be of service? 
Ah, another page. Aha, it's a similar cipher to the last one. This won't take long. Interesting. Hmm. Indeed. I see. It's another blade design for delivering poison. Can you a poison it? blade. Oh, see, I remember that. I just need to find a way to hollow out the blade without sacrificing the... It's all right, Leonardo. Just do what you need to do. All done. I filled your blade with a bit of poison to start with. Should you run out, just visit a doctor. Poison? From a doctor? In high enough doses, that which cures can kill. I am in your debt once more, my friend. Anytime, Ezio. Anytime. Poison. Oh, I love the poison. You'll see why. Yeah, in the next video we will definitely come back to the city to visit the temple. Well, for sure. Oh, the fast travel station. Okay, screw this, I'll just go through there. Ooh, the Assassin's Tube, uh, I'm sorry, Tomb is uh, unlocked for us to travel in. That was another exclusive item that I bought uh, through the Ubisoft Club website for this game. Other than the uh, Altair outfit. Collect income. Uh, okay. Buongiorno. Salute, Sir Ezio. Shall we take a look at the list? Okay, let's repair the brothel. And the mines. And let's give everybody a church. And the military barracks. Let's start up the Thieves Guild. Buon viaggio! Okay, let's go upstairs and turn o over the, fe the feathers that we've gotten. one place seal okay only five more to go yeah I know I should get on with the next uh, main <laughs> mission in, but to what do we owe the honor? We'll have to do it at another time. Okay. Because I think we are going to stop here. And when we come back, we will go back to that city. And we will visit the next Assassin's Tomb. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And be sure to give a like and subscribe. And hit the notification bell to stay updated for more content from my channel. Until then, catch you later.